Okay guys, we prefer to eat the lunch at home. So let's see what did we order for the lunch. So as many of you ask, we have ordered today Megana Biryani. Let's see such a nice packing. What do we have here? I think this is right up. Other. Mm. And two buckets of biryani. <laughs> what is it? Okay. Let's see what is inside. We have ordered a special biryani. Let's see in each one of these what of that. I think this we have to with the right item. So this is a chicken of the biryani, this is a gravy and this is raita. Let's see how does it taste. Let's start. I think this food is very spicy. Let's see. And I brought the green chili also. This much rice is too much for two percent. For us, know. we don't eat this much. I think this is enough for three or four person. Yeah. So first Maybe. time when I went to Hyderabad, I had a biryani there for first time. Really, really wonderful. Now we will mix like this, right up on top of the mountain. Mm -hmm. We make it like this. Then with the finger, we go deep like this. Wow. It's so ugly. The look is not nice. <laughs> when you are making the rice, should give a something. <laughs> this is what I have seen from my friends and other people who are eating biryani. It should become like this, from middle of your finger, rice should come out. Before I had a biryani from um, Empire, but it's the first time we changed our restaurant. And this Merghani biryani, biryani. biryani is really very delicious. Then. We will see, like this you will take. Okay. Make it one separate. No, I don't want. See, like this. Then you will do like this, then you will lift. <laughs> and with this finger. You made the semen. With this finger, yeah. Huh? <laughs> ah! <laughs> Damn. <laughs> really, is it tasty with the chair? Right. No, I don't want. I don't want to mix together. I will separately like it. Separately, but separately. This one. I don't like it. Then like this again. Mm. Don't make it sound. With the sound is more tasty. Please. <laughs> I don't like. Two times I went to Hyderabad. Both time I had a biryani. One was mutton biryani, one was chicken biryani. I can say this is the best biryani I ever had. Is the mutton biryani? Yes, yes, yes. Same, same as one has the mutton also. But I prefer to eat the chicken, chicken biryani. biryani. 
Before I have this Bellini, I was not a Bellini fan. Now, yeah. <clears throat> if I want to order any things, I, my first choice is Bellini. So guys, many of you ask for uh, to try the Megana Bellini. Yeah. So now I'm asking you, as we are living in Bangalore, introduce me one restaurant which we can have a best south rest, uh, food in uh, Bangalore okay. area. So far, thank you very much for the introducing us the Megana Biryani. This is the best. So please introduce us some restaurant which is uh, serving the South Indian food. I think the South is mostly seafood. Yeah. Mostly. And I'd like to try the mm. uh, new food like the fish, fish curry, something yeah. like this. We went uh, in Kochi, we had many uh, seafood. As you can go and see our vlog regarding the Kochi tree, we had many seafood. Yeah. Their food was nice also. Prawn. That fish, thing. one fish, I, I don't remember what was that fish name. They made the fried fish for us and it was yeah delicious. Really tasty. And one thing I liked in Kochi was those uh, street food. People were sitting on... Yeah, it was so cool. Mm, nice. Nice and uh, it was so cool. Because uh, till uh, late of night, everyone was outside and they were walking together and the city was alive. For example, in Bangalore, most of the place after 10 o'clock, the city... Oh, it was before. Now it's open. For example, I remember when I came in uh, many of Iranian my Iranian friend used to live in New Bell Road. So, 9.30, 10 o'clock, New Bell Road was full dead. You could not see any shop open. But now many restaurants are open till 12.30, 1 o'clock. Restaurants, yes. But uh, if you remember in Kochi, but it was because of the tourists. Yes. Because there is so many tourists coming from different, different countries. With the sheep, yeah? They come with the sheep. They come with the sheep. And uh, Kochi is the nice place. And uh, I like to visit different places in the Kerala. Um, because I know Kerala has a, um, so many beautiful cities. And we will go. We will go visit there. Yes, we have to go for the <clears throat> those boats. Yeah. And uh, Kerala language is <coughs> Malayal Malayalam. Mm -hmm. Yeah, correct. And it is so different from the uh, Kannada, Kannada language. Karnataka language. Yeah. Oh. I will cut the video. Doros is Amin Khuda. Like this, they will do enough. So, I'm a plant fan in Iran. We have one greenhouse plant nursery, so we used to keep a lot of plants and flowers. So, once we came here, we cannot live without plants, especially rare plants. So, I try to collect all type of philodendron. All type of scandies. So this is begonia. Taking care of this plant is very difficult. And this is the monstera. It's a very nice plant. If you want to keep this plant in your house, you should have a lot, very good 
a rotation in your house otherwise it will start growing some fungi if you see this gut fungi i have put lot of fertilizer and antifungi for the plants so after lunch we watering our plants then we will have a persian tea baby come drink your tea we have only one sweet we will eat together <laughs> We will cut and eat together. So what's the best thing to do after lunch? <clears throat> grab your joystick. Okay. <laughs> turn on the TV. And the, what good wife should to do? The good wife should bring, bring the, the tea, tea. <laughs> when you're playing the game. Fatima. Fatima will come. Wait. Let me see any of my friends are online. No. 